Currently the Marvel Cinematic Universe has more than 30 film series that have interrelated storylines. But not everyone can easily understand the sequence of Marvel movies. The sequence of Marvel films is not only seen by the release date, but also based on the chronology of events. So, to understand it better, consider the following sequence of Marvel films that have been arranged based on the chronology of events. For the record, there are several Marvel films whose chronology of events occurs simultaneously. For example, the story in Thor Ragnarok, takes place around the same time as the events in Ant-Man and the Wasp. Both films lead directly to Avengers Infinity War. The Marvel Cinematic Universe films are divided into three phases that make up the Infinity Saga. Starting from the movie Iron Man to the movie Avengers Endgame. Then the fourth phase begins with the WandaVision, Black Widow, and Shang-Chi. Here is the order of the Marvel Cinematic Universe films based on the chronology of events. Number 1. Captain America The First Avenger is the first in a Marvel film based on the chronology of events. This film is set in 1941, where the world is at war. Steve Rogers at that time wanted to be part of the American Armed Forces. However, he was rejected by the military because of his thin, small, and weak appearance. In the end, Steve got his chance when he was accepted into an experimental program that turned him into a super soldier named Captain America. In this film, we can see how Steve Rogers was created as a super soldier. Along with Bucky Barnes and Peggy Carter, Captain America leads the war against the Nazi-backed organization Hydra. From this film, you will know the origins of the Tesseract, which later became the Infinity Stone. Number 2 Captain Marvel is the second Marvel film sequence based on the chronology of events. With the setting in 1995, this film tells the character of Carol Denver. He descends to Earth and targets the shape-shifting alien Skrulls. In this film, we can find out why Nick Fury has one eye and how Nick Fury asked Captain Marvel for help when Thanos came to Earth. Number 3. In third place is Iron Man, which was released in 2008. This film tells the origin of Iron Man which is the idea of a genius billionaire, namely Tony Stark. Initially, he was kidnapped by a group of terrorists who were after his most advanced weapon system. But, because of his genius Tony Stark managed to make the technology that made him known as Iron Man. Number 4 In the film Iron Man 2, Tony Stark clashed with the government who wanted to master the technology because it was considered quite dangerous at the time. In addition, this film also features other Avenger members, namely Black Widow and War Machine. Number 5. In this film we will see Bruce Banner as the Hulk who runs away from General Thunderbolt Ross and the U.S. military who considers him a threat. Initially, the Hulk will be played by Edward Norton but was replaced by Mark Ruffalo in 2012 until now. Number 6. This film tells of Thor who was exiled to Earth by his father named Odin and tried to return to his original place. The reason for Thor's exile is related to his younger brother, Loki, who will later have an important role in the Marvel Cinematic Universe film. Number 7. In seventh place based on the chronology of events is The Avengers, which was released in 2012. In this film, several hero characters join a team, namely The Avengers, with the enemy they must fight as Loki. The younger brother of Thor managed to master the Tesseract which was assisted by an alien group. Number 8 There is a saying, there is no hero who will always look great. Back again with the story of Iron Man, in this film we will see the fragile point of Iron Man. With everything he has, there have been instances where he has been quite hit and mentally affected. Then Tony became obsessed with creating an army of robots commanded by him. This film also has an interesting side with the appearance of Pepper Potts to add to the conflict in this film. Number 9 In this film, Thor is told to try to overcome all the remnants of the destruction previously caused by Loki and Asgard. You will be shown the struggle for weapons with ether elements which will later become one of the Infinity Stones. Number 10 After the events in the Avengers movie, Steve Rogers officially joined S.H.I.E.L.D. Even so, 
In this film will be shown some suspicious characters behind S.H.I.E.L.D. In addition, Steve also met his best friend whom he thought had died several years ago, namely Winter Soldier or Bucky Barnes. Number 11. Guardian of the Galaxy is one of the films that is quite important because it also features one of the Infinity Stones. With a talking raccoon named Rockets, and a tree named Groot, Guardian of the Galaxy managed to present a more colorful story in the MCU. Although his opponent is Ronan the Accuser, the MCU is starting to manifestly feature Thanos who in time will become the most important character in the third phase of Marvel films. Number 12 Peter Quill and the other Guardians of the Galaxy are hired by the Sovereign who is an alien race. The goal is to get back their stolen battery in exchange for Nebula, Ronan's underling who is a prisoner. After completing the mission, Rocket secretly took several batteries belonging to the Sovereign, which the Sovereign's troops chased after them. Number 13 The Avengers reunited for the second time to fight an AI named Ultron. Ultron is the creation of Tony Stark and Bruce Banner which turns into a disaster for human life. This film also features several important characters, namely the Scarlet Witch, Quicksilver, and Vision, the physical version of Jarvis which is the AI of Iron Man. Number 14 If there is a Hulk who becomes a big hero, there is also a hero who has the power to turn into a small creature, namely Ant-Man. The film stars Paul Rudd, an ordinary villain who Hank Pym recruits to wear the Ant-Man suit, so the technology doesn't fall into the wrong hands. N Number 15 In this film, almost all Avengers except Thor appear even though this film is not called an Avenger film. In addition to the Avengers, there are the appearance of Black Panther and Spider-Man characters in this film. Captain America again shows his emotional side to his best friend. Bucky Barnes, who is considered to be the perpetrator of the explosion at the UN office, which killed Black Panther's father. Because of this incident, the Avengers are divided into two, the pros and cons of Captain America. Number 16. After a long time, finally Black Widow has a film of its own. This latest Marvel film is about Natasha Romanoff's exile period after the events of Captain America. Number 17. It must be admitted that in this film Tom Holland is very suitable to play the character of the comic version of Spider-Man with the characteristics of a clumsy high school student. Here, Spider-Man must fight the vultures who use alien items from the Battle of New York as weapons. Number 18. In this film, Marvel presents something new among the previous Marvel films because it displays unique and different powers from other heroes. Stephen Strange is a world-renowned surgeon. However, an accident left his hand badly injured and unable to function as usual which made him very depressed. Until finally he found the power of ancient magic that can be used for good in his journey to heal the wounds he suffered. In this film we will see the power of one of the Infinity Stones, namely the Time Stone. Number 19 Black Panther has finally made its own film this time by Marvel. T'Challa immediately became a fan-favorite character of the Marvel Cinematic Universe after previously appearing in the film Captain America Civil War. In this film, he must fight Eric Killmonger who is a villain due to his father's mistakes in the past. Number 20 Thor Ragnarok is the next film in a sequence based on the chronology of events in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. After Odin's death, the character Hela appears. Thor's long-lost sister who wants to usurp the throne of Asgard. Number 21. This is Scott Lang's film after his last appearance in Civil War, where he stood on the side of Captain America against government policies. This resulted in a sentence that he had to serve under house arrest and not be able to meet Hank Pym and his son, Hope. This film also tells the story of Hope's mother who is trapped in the quantum realm, a world that does not know space and time that can make a person trapped forever. Number 22. After a long wait, Thanos finally intervened himself to Earth to collect all the Infinity Stones after previously getting the Power Stone from Planet Xander. In the end Thanos managed to wipe out half of humanity in the universe, 
including some of the Avengers, in an event known as the Blip. Number 23. Endgame is set five years after the events caused by Thanos. The surviving Avengers try to restore conditions by traveling through time to prevent the blip from happening by utilizing Ant-Man's quantum realm, which has abilities like a time machine. In this film, Doctor Strange's role is very important considering he is the only member of the Avengers who has mastered magical powers and has previously seen the future with the possibility of winning against Thanos. This film is a reunion and farewell opportunity for the Avengers. Number 24. Starting from this film to the next list is a sequence of Marvel films after Endgame. Many events happen to the world, including the heroes of Marvel after the events of the blip. Spider-Man Far From Home is the first film to tell the story after the heroes were successfully brought back to life as well as being the last Marvel film in Phase 3. In this film, Spider-Man must fight Mysterio, who needs help fighting the Elementals. Number 25. Shang-Chi is the eldest son of Wen Wu, the head of the powerful Ten Rings crime organization. Actually, since childhood, he considered his father as a good and great figure. However, without realizing it, the father also hopes that Shang-Chi will grow up to be an evil and cruel figure to be his successor. In his first mission to kill, Shang-Chi rebelled and fled from the organization. And several years later, his encounter with the evil group Ten Rings who want to steal the locket left by his mother makes Shang-Chi have to regroup with his family. But what happened the family meeting did not go well. Shang-Chi is caught in a dilemma, whether to help his father's evil plan or stop him. Number 26. This film presents the story of a group of heroes from outer space who have protected Earth since the dawn of human civilization. Number 27. Based on the chronology of events, this is the sequence of the next Marvel films. In this film, Peter Parker, played by Tom Holland, gets a bad reputation due to the slander he received from Mysterio. To make things right, he meets Doctor Strange with the aim of asking Strange for help so he can cast a spell to make people forget about Spider-Man. However, due to a spell error, it actually affects the safety of the Earth, where the boundaries between universes are opened, so that creatures from other universes come to Earth and chase after Peter Parker. Number 28. Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness is Doctor Strange's second solo film and the 28th film in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. The film begins with the scene of America Chavez and Defender Strange trying to find the Book of Vishanti and being chased by demons in the inter-universe space. Defender Strange is killed and Chavez accidentally creates a portal that takes him and Defender Strange's corpse to Earth-616, Strange's planet in the MCU main universe and later saves Chavez from the demon octopus with the help of the Sorcerer Supreme, Wong. Chavez explains that the demon is hunting him because he has the unique power to travel across the universe. Number 29. Thor, Love and Thunder is a direct sequel to Thor. Ragnarok in the 29th film in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. This film tells of Thor who must return to action and recruit Valkyrie, Korg, and Jane Foster to stop Gore the God Butcher who intends to eliminate all the gods. <laughs>